Hey, this is my little face totem pole. It's tweet tap time again. We follow everyone so you don't have to. So you, don't even, you don't even worry about it. You don't even have to do it. We're doing it. I'm your host, Mike Falzone, alongside Coffee Girl. If you're unfamiliar with what Coffee Girl does, watch this. Way wire, stay wire. See that? Stupid? Oh, man. Let's read the internet together. By together, I mean I'll do it. You just sit there. President Obama held his first press conference since his re-election yesterday afternoon, taking questions on the Petraeus investigation, Syria, Benghazi, and the fiscal cliff. However, his response to how his admin will address global warming faced criticism from the left. Washington Post Chris Cizia says, Washington Post. Hold on. Sil Siliza. Washington Post. The the Washington Post's. There's a apostrophe S. Like Reese's. Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. The Washington Post's Chris Cizia. Cizia. What did I say it was? Cizia. No, there's two L's. Cizia. Cizia. Is it a Yia situation? Siliza. Ask me, Chris. Chris Saliza. This guy. Saliza. Okay. Washington Post's Chris Saliza tweets, Shorter Obama answer on climate change. We aren't going to do anything. But isn't that what you want? Short and sweet? That is actually the translation of the transcript that you can go read to the side. Go re it won't take much time. It didn't say much. But what could you really do about global warming as, as the president? Influence change across the country on how people act and live? When does that ever happen? It hasn't. That seemed appropriate. Can we get a little rainbow trail on that? Is that possible? Maybe some stars falling down? That seemed appropriate. Also, this is creepy as shit. Twitter hittery. Twitter hittery. Twitter history. Rewind. <laughs> also, Twitter history was made yesterday when Israeli defense forces live tweeted their campaign to attack Hamas and Islamic Jihad targets in Gaza. First they did this. The first target hit minutes ago was Ahmad al-Jabari, head of the Hamas military wing. That's creepy as sh**. You remember World War II? Totally. You do, right? So there was a point in our country, in America, and I don't mean to bring America into this, but it's the only country I've ever been a part of. Except for that one time I got real drunk in Toronto. So when we were in older wars, when we would do something, it would be unanimous. And everyone would be like, yeah, that's a great idea to attack that thing or that person. And the whole country would be like, yip, yip, hooray. I didn't read transcripts from back then, but I can only imagine they said something similar. Read so. No, no, no. Transcripts. Okay, I'm there was sorry. no Tweely Deets back then. Only the birds tweeted. <laughs> oh. Getting better. <laughs> so, my guess I'm just a guy sitting engine style on a rug. But I think that the military going on Twitter, it's like a push to recreate this sense of nationalism. And maybe if people see it on Twitter, they can get behind who their country is killing. I don't know how well it's gonna work. It's just creeping me the hell out. But maybe some 13 year old would be like, well, we're killing people on Twitter now, so might as well get behind this. Got behind that whole Twilight thing. And then things got real spicy, and this happened. The Bahrainian Ministry of Foreign Affairs tweets, The Kingdom of Bahrain condemns Israeli attack on the Gaza Strip. So now we have like full on... A tweet war? Yeah, but like why do we even have like a UN now? <laughs> Rapper Wiz Khalifa's a little animal on stage. You know how I know? Because he tweeted, I'm a little animal on stage. <laughs> oh, Wiz. That's it. Tell us what your alter ego is. Mine is a hairier version of me. This has been Tweet Tap. My name is Mike Falzone. This is Coffee Girl. You know, you wait till I introduce you. You yell at me for not being on the ball. <laughs> now I'm on the ball and I get yelled at. I just want to yell. I never get to yell. My name is Mike Falzone. This is Coffee Girl. Coffee girl. <laughs> <laughs> what are you supposed to say? Oh. I put out new videos every Tuesday and Friday, probably. <laughs> Here's hoping. Ugh, got runny nosies. Oh! We never have tissues. We do. They're way wire, stay drizzly. You gotta entertain the people when I'm not on camera. And they don't even see my face. You're like, I don't know, something with just a voice. The Charlie's Angel guy. Charlie. Right? Oh. Welcome, angels. <laughs> Welcome, angels. Stay wired. <laughs>